Both teams are on the field, and we're just about ready to open things up. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. He scrambled. He's tackled at about the 33 yard line. He tackles him for a loss. That is just a great play getting into the backfield. This guy is so quick that the ball carrier never had a chance. From their own 28 yard line. Third down. Here we go. Watch seven. Watch seven. Watch seven. Watch seven. Go, go. He's rid of it quickly, and that was almost picked. These guys were ready for the pass and played it well to come up with the deflection. Oh, excellent punt. And he's tackled at the 41. The Bears in talking with them this week, Kirk, is just interesting, their perspective on this kid, how good he is, and how much they can lean on him. Yeah, you and I had a chance to visit with not only the coaches, but the player himself. And I got a real good vibe walking out of those meetings and, and thinking that he's going to have a huge game. The coaches seem confident in being able to get him the football in different areas on the field. This kid has a look in his eye that I haven't seen in a long time where he just wants to have a chance to have an impact on the game and on the outcome. And I'll be shocked if they can slow him down. Quick pass, and they push him out at the 48-yard line. Kill, kill, kill! taken down at the 45. That's a key play to find the open man and keep the drive alive. First down. Mike 7. Mike 7. Hey, kill, kill, kill. X7. Where? make it second and four. Kill, kill. X7. Fires complete over the middle. Tackle at the 23. That one goes for good yardage and a first down. Yeah, that's just a nice gain on second down. Let's see if this coaching staff sticks with the short passing game or if they decide to open it up a bit more. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 23-yard line. Watch 14. Watch 14. Seven to Mike. Mike seven. Go! Wears it out to the right to the halfback. He made a good read here to find his teammate. That's sound decision-making. That'll bring up third and four. Tries to fit it in there, but it's picked off. And he hits him hard at the 19. Not a good decision there. Why'd he even throw that pass? Well, it's a good job by the corner of sitting back and reading the quarterback's eyes. Good job of disguising coverage as well. First and 10. Ball on their own 19. Makes the catch and look out. 
He gets hit out of bounds around the 34-yard line. He showed some excellent moves out there, more than you usually expect from a tight end. That was a big gain, and this offense keeps humming along. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. Quickly to the tight end, incomplete. I mean, he has his wide receiver wide open. You spend all those hours during the week to be able to get prepped and ready to go. You got an open man like this, just step and deliver and make the throw. Pass is caught, the defense lays him out. That's good to know. That'll make it 35. Quick strike, and he drops it. And that'll bring up a punting situation. Yeah, they just couldn't connect on a pass there. That was a very good stand by this defense. And this one is a beauty. They bring him down, and they bring him down hard on that one. And so far, it's been totally even. In close games like this, every possession is likely to matter. There's a strike complete. That brings up second and one. Right around the 32-yard line. Never really had a shot. They were on him almost as soon as he took the handoff. From their own 32-yard line. Third down. Throws complete. He's got room to work. That's a great tackle. The 37-yard line. Hey, it's a, it's a first down for this offense that keeps everybody enthusiastic. You can see the momentum that this offense is gaining. The coaches and the players on the sideline are fired up, and hey, it's a new set of downs. Makes it out to maybe the 40-yard line. That'll make it second and seven. Slings it. And they make the stop around the 49 yard line. That's good for the end of nine yards. First down. Easy, easy. Red seven, red seven. 20. And he shoved out of bounds at the 46. Second and five. Mike, Mike seven. Check, check, black five. Red seven, red seven. He's on the run. Nice grab on the play. Heading for the corner. And he's tackled at about the 27 yard line. That makes it first and 10. He fires left side, and it's intercepted. And that was just an outstanding pick. Great play by the defender to high point the ball, but the quarterback wasn't in rhythm on the throw. From their own 10 yard line. It's first down. Ready. Blue for the spot. Blue for the spot. Motion, motion, motion. Oh. We played one. Still no score. That makes it second and ten.
And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set to start the second quarter. They'll spread the field with five wide. And he just gets rid of it. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. They'll line up at the 11. Third down. He made the catch, but he didn't get the first down. Yeah, well, right now, the way this defense is swarming, there's just no room for him to get upfield for the first down. Everybody up close. It looks like they're coming after this kick. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. He makes it out to maybe the 46-yard line. Made a few guys miss on his way to a quality return. Well, let's see if he can shake off that pick that he tossed last time out. And we'll see how aggressive this defense is when they come back out. I wouldn't be surprised if they kept up the pressure to try to fluster this quarterback some more. And he tackles him hard at the 39. Brad, not only did they give up a sack here, but their quarterback just got hit and hit hard. If I'm an offensive coordinator, especially an offensive line coach, I'm getting a hold of my offensive line, making sure these guys are on the same page, and they've got to take more pride in taking care of their quarterback than that play right there. So the sack makes this a second and long. Mike 7, Mike 7. Green 9, Green Just throws this one away. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. Quick out to his receiver. And he's taken down at the 42. He has some room. They'll bring him down right around the 30. First down. That's a game of five on the ground. That brings him second and five. Mike seven. Mike kill, kill, kill. Black, black. Orange. What a play, and that is first and goal. So the offense back in the red zone here and looking to erase the memory of that interception on their last trip. Easy, Gives it to the back. Tackle outside after a nice pickup. That brings in second and goal. Touchdown, Bears! And he adds the extra point. So that's an eight-play, 53-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. The score now, 7-0. Baylor to kick this one off. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. Throws complete, and he's hit right away. He's on the run, looking for the corner. Tackle made around the 40-yard line. 
He gained a couple of yards on the keeper. That makes it second and eight. Now he's scrambling. Brought down at about the 43 yard line. Second down. Five wide. You know, at that point, I think, Brad, the quarterback's just better off just taking a sack. You have to be very careful as you're feeling pressure to throw the ball just to throw the ball. If you feel like you're not going to be able to make a play and the defense got you, just give up on that play and get ready for the next down. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry, and he's hit immediately. There's a strike complete. He's down. Everything about that play was crisp. The route, the throw, the catch. That's fun to see. From the 18-yard line, second down. And they'll get him in the backfield. Sometimes a play is not going to work for whatever reason. Doesn't mean you throw the play away. You just need to execute better next time. This is the 11th play of this drive. Watch seven. Watch seven. Watch seven. They're going to need some therapy. Go, go. And he can't stay in bounds, but they'll have it first and goal. Fires it out. I love to see this quarterback respond when this offense really needs him to pick him up. Your quarterback's performance on third down is vital to your team's success. First and goal, and if they can execute, we'll be all tied up. Got to be careful of a pass play with this defense. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. The defense got a great push and blew that play up well behind the line of scrimmage. 13th play of the drive coming up in the shotgun and five wideouts. Touchdown, Utah! A powerful push by the line and a really nice run. That'll get you into the end zone almost every time. Here comes the kicker to try to tie this game up. And he tacks on the extra point. Utah is lining up to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. And they can forget about returning this one. Right now, this game's got all the makings of maybe being a nail biter. Yeah, this game just feels like it's going to go well into the second half, probably into the fourth quarter. You almost have a feel that maybe one of the defenses may have to score a touchdown to be able to win this game. You always want to go in the locker room with momentum. So as we get closer to halftime, I think we'll see more and more attempts to create big plays. Runs with it, and he's got room. And he is drilled at the 34-yard line. About nine yards there for the quarterback. Short yardage situation here. Second down and one. They bring the quarterback down. First down. Oh my, what a run on third down. Still a foot or two away. That's unfortunate. You run all that way, make the right moves to put you in position to get a first down, then it comes down to just a couple inches. Tackle made at the 26. There's a 
last time we saw this offense on the field, they drove the length of the field. And you think back to what that defensive coordinator tried to do. He tried to change some things up, but nothing seemed to work. It's going to be interesting to see how he can have an impact on this drive. That brings, that brings up, up second and nine. nine. So at the end of the half, we get a tie game at 7-7. Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Chris Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. These two defenses so far, they've been everything they've been advertised to be. They've stopped the run. They've limited the passing game. They apply pressure at the right time. It's going to be hard to find holes to move the ball at all in the second half. Yeah, and sometimes it's really bad offense. And sometimes you can also look at those holes and they come open and all of a sudden they close really fast. And, and that's what you're seeing. A lot of guys that are really athletic, really fast. They know where to be. A, a lot of guys that you'll be seeing playing on Sundays. I mean, it's just a lot of talent to overcome and you got to be in the right position, but then you got to beat those great players that are also in the right position. So I, I expect more of the same, but you know, which team can break through and make a huge play to, to take the other one, you know, off guard a little bit and, and make that big play. I can only hope that Nestler and Herb Street will bring the same type of intensity to their call of the second half that David and I have brought to the halftime show. Of course, they always do. That's it for us here in the studio. Time to get you back out to the guys for the second half. Boy, I hope the second half's as good as the first. Just about set to start the third quarter in a tight one. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. You don't want to squander any possessions, but maybe now's the right time to dip into your bag of tricks a little. Think about some gadget plays to catch the defense napping. Up the middle for a nice game. Play action. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. Tackle around the 41-yard line. That's a team of nine on the play. First down. He's under pressure. Slides down. That makes it second and six. Hey, kill, kill, kill. Green nine. Green nine. And he's hit immediately. They didn't have much of a chance on that play. Boy, this defense has a lot of speed. They're all over him by the time he caught the ball. And they get nice yardage on that run. That's a team six on that play. From the 47-yard line, first down. Dog four. Green. Hits him hard at the 46 yard line. That brings us second and nine. Green nine. Yellow three. Yellow three. Seven. Yellow three. Quick throw. Yellow three. 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 That's good for a gain of four yards. That'll make it third and five. Kill, kill, kill. Gun and three. I love the toughness here by this quarterback of sitting in until the last second, trying to make a play downfield, only to have this defense get to him. 
Got to do a better job maybe feeling things out a little bit, but at least he has the awareness and a toughness to sit in that pocket. Kicks away, and he nails the long field goal. up for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Let's go! He might have a chance. So he picks up about five on the option to the halfback. Of one there for the halfback. That is a loss of one yard. Third and six. We've got a third and six here. Ball on the 29. That's a great tackle at the 47. to the back. And he's knocked down immediately after the catch. He's taken down at the 15-yard line. who can do things like that. The coach probably loves drawing up plays for this guy. He makes the PAT. So that's a seven-play, 74-yard drive. And they come away with a touchdown. You know, this offensive line has done a really good job. But really, I think it's more about the big play ability from the running backs and why we've seen so many big plays from this offense. He's to the 20. And he's taken down at the 22-yard line. Man, both offenses here in this third quarter have been on fire. Time for the defense to step to the forefront a little bit. Makes you wonder which of these defenses has the ability to come up and make a stop. It could be one of those games where whichever defense comes up with that stop could be the team that wins the game. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. Now he tries to buy some time. And now he's going to run. And he's tackled at the 49. That's good for the 29 yards. That makes it first and 10. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. Easy. Scrambling around. He gets sacked on the play. Defense looking for another sack in this second down and long situation. And he just gets rid of it. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. And this one's broken up. And that 
That'll make it fourth down. On third down, the defense was expecting the pass, and they defended the play very well in the secondary. And he's got to be happy with that punt, Kirk. Yeah, Brad, that was nice. And now they're looking at a long way to go to even think about a score. It's early in this game, so the defense can still have an opportunity to make some adjustments. But if things don't turn around in a hurry, it's really going to start to affect the psyche of that go. defensive line. Right. And he's taken down the 21 yard line. You know what? After a play like that, I wouldn't be the least bit surprised if they went to the air again. Utah holds a four-point lead. And they make the stop at the 16. When this guy gets his arms around the ball carrier, I don't care who it is. He's not getting away. Third down, six to go. Ball on the 16-yard line. Quick out to his receiver. They'll bring him down at the 28. There's a strike complete. Tackle made at about the 33 yard line. That brings him second and five. Check 82, watch 82, ball's coming 82. He's on the run. He gets to about the 41 yard line. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Tackles him hard at the 48. They'll line up with five wide receivers. He makes it to the 45-yard line. It's been a defensive masterpiece through three. Who'll draw up points in the final quarter? Utah's up by four. Back in this very pivotal fourth quarter. Utah is up by four. Gains his way to the 30 yard line. Carries it again, and he's tackled in the backfield. He just never had a chance to get any running room. The defense was on him almost as soon as the ball was snapped. Third down, and they need to get it down to the 20. right on target so that took a perfectly timed hard hit to knock it free strong defense to deny the completion the kick is up it's got the distance and he splits the uprights boy he had plenty of distance there and pushed it through very impressive leg strength 17 10 utah he just drills this one and it sails out of the end zone for a touchback Things aren't tied, but they might as well be. It's this drive that could really dictate the tone for the last quarter. They go with the run, and he's taken down behind the line. From their own 23-yard line, second down. Black 
slings it. He's tackled at the 36. That's a game of 13 on the play. First down. Mike, seven. Red, kill. Orange, three. Orange, three. Brought down at the 46. Game of 10 on the play. First down. Right around the 46 yard line. That's a deal of nine on the play. That makes it third and three. Red two. Yellow three. Blue 20. Yellow three. He's going to come up short. Good tackle. So they're going to go for it here. Less than three minutes in the game. Level at the 43 yard line. That makes it first and ten. Seven, Mike, seven. Black, five, black, five, black yellow, five, three, yellow, three, yellow, three, yellow, three. Yellow, three. Yellow, three. And he's tackled at the positive yardage. That's good for the game of seven yards. That'll bring up second and three. Easy, two, easy. green, 15, Blue, 20. Check, check, check. Ah. Fires it out. He's knocked out of bounds. Around the 36 yard line. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. First down. Kill, kill, kill. 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 Gunner three. Eight. Check, 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 check. 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 Gains his way to the 19 yard line. First down. Makes it out to maybe the 19-yard line. A yard, if that, on the quarterback keeper. And that was the sophomore linebacker there who was able to get in and make that tackle. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 19-yard line. He gets out to about the 11-yard line. Just over a minute in the fourth quarter. Nice run up the middle. That makes it first and goal. Makes a move and he's in for the touchdown. Extra point to tie this game up. And he converts the extra point. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Late in the fourth quarter now, game is tied. Which coach can outcoach the other? It's a chess match right now. Oh, 
Gets it. He's in space. He's pushed out of bounds at about the 21. Third down and 14 to go. Ball on the 21-yard line. Down the throw. He caught it. And down he goes at the 49-yard line. Under a minute left. He heaves it to the end zone. The defender had his hands on it, but it's incomplete. Hey, that's a heads up play there by the defenders. Get those hands up and something good may just happen. From their own 49 yard line, second down, five wide. Looking for his man, incomplete. Just a tremendous play there late in the fourth quarter in a tie football game. And now it all comes down to the final seconds or overtime. Oh, excellent punt. This punt bounces into the end zone, and this will be a touchback. Late in the fourth quarter in a one-possession game. And poise is what it's all about here. Who's going to have it and who won't? And he throws it away. From their own 20-yard line, it's second down. Gets hit out of bounds right around the 24 yard line. Gain of four on the play. That'll bring up 36. Seven's the mic. Dog four. Well, you can see the elation on the defensive coordinator side of things, and why not? His defense just came up with one of the biggest stops of the game in a vital spot in this fourth quarter. He makes it out to maybe the 43-yard line. This is when things get a little prickly. You need your playmakers to really come through here. This looks like their last shot to get it to the end zone. Going deep, lays it out there. And he hauls it in at the end of that long ball. And that's the end of the fourth quarter, and we're going to take this deadlock into overtime. Well, we played an hour, and it's still not enough. We're set to kick off here in overtime. Mike seven. Mike seven. Yeah. Hey. Tosses out to the tailback on the screen. Knocked out of bounds at the 20-yard line. Call it a gain of five yards. That brings him second and five. Mike seven. You better bring it. Red kill, 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 green 15, yellow three, check, 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 yellow three. And a quick throw. Third down and they need to get it to the 15. Stays in bounds to make a nice catch. That's good for a game of 12 yards. First down. Green nine, green nine, yellow three, seven, yellow six. And they got him. Oh, that is a big hit on the quarterback. That's one of those as an offensive lineman. When the film study starts to come around, you're going to kind of sink in your chair and just hope they don't call you out because you're going to get embarrassed on Monday on that one. 
from the 18-yard line. It's second down. Fires this one. Looks to a receiver. Touchdown. Well, this is what it's all about in college football. I score. Now we'll see if you can respond. Great teams always find a way to come through. Tax on the extra point. From the 25 yard line, first down. Ready! Black 90! Makes the catch and look out. That's a great tackle at the 13. Throws it in a hurry, and he shoved out of bounds at the 10-yard line. Call it a game of three yards. That'll make it second and seven. On the throw, incomplete pass. You know, Brad, this is one of those plays where the quarterback just wants to apologize to the wide receiver, maybe every other member of this offense. But the wide receiver, if he's smart, will come up to that quarterback, tell him to forget about it, let's move on to the next play. Catches it and hit immediately for a loss. That is a loss of five on the play. That makes it fourth and 12. So they'll get one last stab at tying this up. Take go! Motion, 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 motion! Quick throw, tight end, touchdown! So with their backs against the wall, they find a way. Get ready for another overtime, folks. There is nothing more exciting than watching four down football in overtime. What a game today. Here comes the kicker to try to tie this game up. And he hits the PAT. Well, it's going to take another round at least. You can bet the coaches are going to look to be more aggressive on both sides of the ball. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 25. And the halfback picks up nine yards on the delay. That brings up second and one. is a lot closer from the one yard line second down he's taken down right around the two yard line that is a loss of one yard that makes it third and goal Touchdown, Utah! 
So the offense steps up and gets a big six points here in double overtime. And that gives them some breathing room for the time being. But I'll tell you, the way this game is being played, I wouldn't be surprised if we saw this offense on the field again in a third overtime. He splits the uprights with the extra point. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 25-yard line. Nearly intercepted. to the 15. with five wide receivers. And two. Intercepted. Game over. to look at this somehow as a positive. Their star player had a great game. They just got to look the next week. Yeah, it's tough anytime you lose a game to be positive, but if there is anything to be positive about, it's about that performance by this individual. He, he really did everything that he could do to try to win this football game. Unfortunately, the team ends up losing, but they can't build to the future around his abilities for sure. That's going to do it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Street, this is Brad Nessler saying goodbye.